Today is Thursday, March 21, 2019, Pakarunga, New Zealand. That man you see walking in front of me is one of the China national residents living in this area. This area is called Pakuranga and uh, it is east of Auckland. It's an area where the Chinese migrants tend to like to stay and uh, so far I noticed there's one motel here and uh, this motel is very busy so I booked an Airbnb actually and uh, I'm staying there just further ahead on the right. Now I'm viewing this road as you can see there's a traffic jam going up the town and this traffic jam gets worse at 9 a.m. Now you can see today is Thursday you have this dustbin men coming to clear the bin that's why they put it outside here on the main road for them to pick up it's on Thursday today is Thursday now I'm staying in number 242 and uh, this house is owned by somebody from Shanghai and it's for sale at 680,000 New Zealand dollars it's part of a development with a retail shops here beauty, spa and the eastern healing center inside so this is the three bedroom house We've been upstairs, one common bathroom, and uh, we have staircase to go up now. As you can see, it's quite spacious. Rented from Airbnb, fully equipped kitchen, and uh, there's a bathroom downstairs as well. So, overall, I would say. It is okay. It's considered quite clean, neat, and uh, this is in east of Auckland, in a place called Pakarunga. P. This is the name card from the motor lodge. Where you can see Paka Pakuranga. P A K U R A N G A. Auckland, East Auckland. Now this house has, has all the things needed, TV, living dining room, kitchen, fully equipped, oven, fridge, microwave, dining table, and uh, you can see that uh, Luckily for me, it's not near to the main road because it will be very noisy. That's a disadvantage of renting from Airbnb. You never know whether it is located in the main road. Fortunately, my the unit next to the main road and I'm coming outside here Hey, good morning and uh, as you can see the traffic is heavy going down to the city centre now it's about uh, 8 o'clock
will be worse at 9 a.m. You notice a bus lane? There's a bus lane as well. And uh, cars really respect the bus lane. So this is the development. I will call it a mixed, mixed development with retail and residential. Only that the residential are two stories. It looks to me like semi D's. By definition, two to one, two in one, with a common wall. And uh, this looks like the Chinese migrants from China, they tend to buy up small businesses and start their own business. There's a chiro 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 practice also. And uh, this is probably licensed for commercial use. So you have the chiropractic practice and the massage in one building, and the beauty center and massage in the other building. So this is the house for A, B and B. I rent it for 180 New Zealand dollars a night for two nights. And uh, you only can rent it through Airbnb. You wouldn't know exactly how the neighbors are until you <laughs> arrive there. There's a danger of renting. Airbnb, although you can see the interior from the photographs. I shall stop now just to show, to tell readers that, to tell viewers that you sometimes can be surprised by renting a place next to the road. You have to be careful. And also for Singaporeans, you got to bring more than one multiple plugs because New Zealand has this three point pin which is not uh, suitable for Singapore so you need a multiple adapter to charge your phone your computer and whatever you want to charge I shall stop now this part of Pakuranga, east of Auckland, a place favoured by the Chinese migrants, China. And uh, this house actually is for sale at 680 thousand New Zealand dollars. Today is Thursday, March 21, 2019. Pakaruna, New Zealand. The traffic you see there going. The traffic jam you can see there on the road are the vehicles going down to city centre. And by 9 am, probably the, the cars are really not moving much. I shall stop now. March 192019 Pakaruna East of Auckland